Hello, snowboarders of the internet. I'm your host, Avery Lefebvre, and this is Explained, the show where we break down the tech in the gear you use. In this video, we're going to be talking about structure. What is it? How does it work? And do you need it? So what is structure? Structure refers to the pattern that is stone ground into the base of your snowboard. Basically, what it is, is a way to break up that suction and static cling that happens on a snowboard between the snow. So that way, when you're gliding on that thin layer of water that forms, it funnels it back out. You just get a better glide with the board. It just helps you ride faster and a little more smoother. That sound right there is what structure sounds like in a board. If you can run your fingernail over it and there's nothing going on, there's no structure. There's two ways to get structure into your snowboard. You buy one that actually has a premium stone ground finish on it, like this Capita Black Snowboard of Death here or you take it to a tune shop and you tell them that you want structure put in the base. Now there are multiple options for structure and I could be here all day in a video just talking about the different patterns and how they work. But basically you just want to tell them that you want a crosshatch that's good for the snow that you're riding on. It takes maybe about an hour for them to really do it. So you know, bribe them with some beer, go get a cup of coffee, come back, should be done or leave it overnight. That's, that's kind of it. It's a really easy process to get a stone grind on a snowboard from a solid tune shop. The thing about structure is it changes how that board rides on snow. If you're in colder, like more dense snow, you know, it will help it funnel. It will allow that board to plane on top of it a lot better. It'll be a smoother ride. You'll notice it right away in there. If you're in slush, spring-like conditions, you have a really deep structure in there, it's basically these little riblets in the base that just allow that water to fly from the nose to the tail, and it breaks up that suction that you get so the board will have a smoother, quicker glide. Do you need structure in your snowboard? No. Is it better? Yes, I firmly believe a good structure in a snowboard will make it ride so much better than just something that has been belt ground, put into a plastic bag and then shipped to you. I mean, if you can actually get a snowboard that has structure put in it, you're gonna notice that it rides smoother, especially in sticky snow. It's just better all the way around. This has been Explained and I've been your host, Averin Lefebvre. Do you agree with having structure in your base? Do you disagree with having structure in your base? Do you have structure in your base? Leave me a comment down below. Let's have a conversation about this. Did you learn what structure is? Good, because if you didn't, there's no hope for you. If you're new here, remember to subscribe, click the bell, get those notifications. That way you're not missing any of the videos we got coming out for all you snowboarders of the internet. And if you'd really like to support us and just help us grow out what we're doing here, swing on over to Angry Snowboarder VIP. I could tell you more here. Got a video over there that explains it so much better. As always, I'll see you guys in another video.